Stock Biz. Legal metrology is one of the most severe laws and it is frequently misunderstood by the companies resulting in heavy fines. Although the act's compliance is very simple, there is a lot of misunderstanding about the legislation which leads to heavy penalties. To carry out correct compliance and work under the Legal Metrology Act, certain registrations and appointments must be made. Hello everyone, this is Yash Saxena and you are watching Cobbiz. In this video, we will discuss Director's nomination under Legal Metrology Act. The nomination of Director is made as per Section 49 of the Legal Metrology Act. The Act permits the user to nominate any person as responsible for the conduct of the business of the company and the services. And hence, the said person shall be responsible for the compliances under Legal Metrology. Let me give you two instances. First is, if the person is appointed as the director of the company and there has been a wrongdoing committed by the company that violates the Legal Metrology Act directly, then being a director of that company, they would be solely accountable and liable for any penalty accordingly. The director will have to pay the fines while the company's security would be assured. The other situation is, if the company does not nominate the director to handle the legal aspects of the business, product or service and the company is found to have committed an act that is in direct contravention to the Legal Metrology Act, then the entire company will be held accountable. Also, the company will be subject to a penalty. The penalty may be anything from a hefty fine to the company's liquidation, depending on the seriousness of the offense. Now you know why nominating a director is important. Moving forward in this video, we will be discussing the requirements, appointment procedure and how to cancel the appointment of the director. So, what are the requirements and procedures for director's nomination? The nomination of director by corporation is explained in section 49 of this legislation. Subsection 7 lays down the company's and nominated director's detailed explanation. The company includes body corporates, further including firms and associations of persons. Directors, on the other hand, refer to the company's agent who undertake its activity on its behalf. For director's nomination, the company follows Section 49.2 of the Legal Metrology Act. The process of director's nomination is as follows. Before appointing, the company first needs to get the approval of the director of the company whom it wants to appoint as the director as per the Legal Metrology Act and that must be in the written form. That is, a written consent is mandatory from the director's side. The company will then issue a written order and company will then notify the director or controller of the Department of Legal Metrology. In case of partnership firm, the partnership firm must also nominate directors under Section 49 of the Legal Metrology Act. Now, let's talk about the circumstances under which the nomination made according to Section 49 of the Legal Metrology Act of 2009 can be cancelled. These are can be cancelled if the company's director, the concerned controller, or any authorized officer has given notice. The person who was nominated is no longer a director of the corporation. He must inform the company's director, concerned controller, or any other authorized officer of this discontinuation. The individual nominated requests that the nomination is cancelled by the company's director, concerned controller, or any authorized authority. The written request must be submitted to the company's director, concerned controller or authorized legal metrology officer. The nomination cannot be revoked before the date specified in the request letter. Legal metrology is the scientific study of weights and measurements, which became law in 2009. Now in the year 2022, legal metrology still necessitates knowledge to investigate all areas of legal metrology. Obtaining a valid metrology license can be both time-consuming and complicated in India. Legal metrology is the subject of expertise that bridges the gap between the rules and acts and the legal metrology procedure in a practical setting. So I hope you must have got a clear idea about how the director is nominated under Legal Metrology Act. For more informative videos, please subscribe to our channel, Cobbis.